gentlemen and welcome back to Twisted Curry. Before I go outside and I start this video properly, well, what a start to the year we've had already. Nothing but rain and uh, before I go any further, I'd like to uh, say thank you to everyone that's got in touch with me. No, I haven't put out a video and it's not because of the retards. It's because it's been pissing down with rain and I just haven't been able to get out there and do anything. Big props to... Uh, Dave from DT Koi for his live and Kyle. Like I said, the retards are out as usual. And we all know who they are. And it doesn't matter how many times your mates turn around and say it's banter. I know it's not. And people are getting pissed off with it. So stop it. And you guys forget. I was on a chat group for you with you for over six months. And... You're just nasty, vile human beings. And that's all I'm going to say on the matter. But I am happy on one thing. My microscope's finally arrived. That arrived the weekend and me and Rocket Boy had a look at it when it arrived. And oh my word. You wait till I show you later. The quality on it is unreal. And uh, I'm glad it's second hand because I would never have been able to afford the 300 odd pound that it uh, <laughs> it would have been brand new and I've got to say a big big thank you to my son Jordan who paid for it for me for my Christmas present thank you son but yeah I'll get that out and then we'll have a look at that over there and later on and uh, a big thank you and a big shout out to my man Skegster from Skegness Pond Supplies he sent me out me uh, me slide valve so uh when we go outside, that is going to be the first job of the day, is to try and get the slide valves onto the uh, the, uh, the multi-bay. Uh, I've got to get hold of Brad later on for a reducer, but hopefully within the next couple of days, I can get that up and running, which will be beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. And like I say, the weather this last week or so has been absolutely biblical. I mean... Jesus Christ, it was bouncing off the pond. Bouncing off the pond. And talking about the pond. Yep, there we are. All the boys and girls are doing well. Makashi is still sulking, but I will be getting the microscope out later and we shall have a look to see what's going on. These over here are doing all right. They're doing all grand in there. One thing I did manage to get done is I managed to get a little bit of uh... Oh, excuse me. Uh, tablets are repeating on me. <laughs> oh. Yep, I managed to get a few bits done in here. Uh, as you know, we uh, we decommissioned uh, Pickles Pond last week. And uh, the, uh, the insulation that went around Pickles Puddle is now up there on the uh, on the old ceiling. So yep, yeah, I know this bit's a little bit thinner, but insulation is insulation. So we've only got two more ridges to do. That's on a clean. And this is the job for today: is to get the slide valves on. Hopefully, I can get hold of Brad later, and we can get the reducer, and then I can get this lot all fired up and running, which would be absolutely wicked. And yep, mind your own business is looking a bit poor after I've given it a bit of a trim, but it'll come back, don't you worry. Don't you worry indeed. Slurp for the skegster. And yes, I'm the consummate child. I don't give a shit. <laughs> At the end of the day, the slurp for skeggy is a private joke between me and skeggy. And if I can get more people doing a slurp for Skeggy, then fucking great. Because I know it winds him up, but he knows that I do it out of fun. It is just done out of pure fun. <laughs> and he knows that. And that's the difference, people. That is the difference. Yeah? Because at the end of the day, I don't like using this word, but if I think you're a cunt, you're a cunt. You know? And I'll tell you that. And if you don't like it, fuck off. You know? 
Stop going, uh, going on and ruining people's fucking evenings just because you think it's fucking funny. Anyway, I'm not going to rant. I'm going to get on with this multi bay. Back to you later, guys. The wind is getting fresh. <laughs> well, that's that bit done. We got return lines all solvent welded into place. As you know, that comes in down uh, there at the back. And we've got shut-offs on those two, and we've got a shut-off on that one. And what I will do is I will bring that across, TP stair, bring it round, and then TP... Oh, nice. Right, I'm going to go from there with a 90. Along, T-piece, along, round, to another T-piece there. And then it will drop down, and then it will connect up with the waist that's going to go down through there. So... Next job, next job is to get that dug out around there a bit so I can get me fitting in there and I can get the pump connected up. And then it's a case of I've got to recycle that one to go in there and then I just need to get hold of Brad later. And then uh, we should be a rocking and a rolling. And just for you, Stubbsy, New Year's. You spin me right round, baby, right round, like a record playing right round, round, round. <laughs> and if you don't know who Stubbsy is, that's Stubbs Aquatics over in Canada. Go over and give Chris a subscribe. Tell him the twisted one sent you. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm glad I've got that bit done. I just wish I had the rubber, yeah, the rubber reducer so I could uh, get that bit done as well. But, hey, beggars can't be choosers, can they? And uh, we can only do what we got materials and tools for. So uh, there we go. But, yep, happy with that. I think what I'm going to do now is I'll get the Alpha Grog out and the Calla Lilies out. And I will get them in that end chamber ready. And then I can put some water into this section here to check all my seals and everything. But, yeah, so... Uh, I'm going to get on and do a little bit of digging out around there so I can get me fitting on. That's, that should be in here. Ah, there it is. There it is. Me fitting I waited over six weeks for. <laughs> so we'll get that on there and we'll come back to you shortly, guys. Hit the ground. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I've, got the, uh, I've got the speaker out and I'm boogieing away while I'm potting around with stuff. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's a good day. Here we go. We got that one's in. That one's in. That one's in. That taps open. We got no leakage. Now let me zoom you out. There we go. So yeah, got me fitting in. Got me pipe working. I'll get some uh, lagging around that. And then all I did. Where's hey, all over my feet? I put a standpipe on that for a minute till I get the ball valve sorted. So, uh, there we go. Ball valve will be sat there straight up into there. Jobs are fucking gudgeon, as my man Kyle would say. And that's Kyle Macakoy, my nutty northern brother. Man, that boy's head shot, but he's a fucking he's got art of gold, art of gold. So, uh, yeah, uh, what else was I going to say? There's a couple of new channels. As soon as I remember them, I'll shout them. <laughs> but don't forget to go over and check Will out. Will's Koi and uh, Wire Bonsai. And Will, if you're listening or you're watching, I've now got my new microscope. So if you want that one that I've got, it's a breaster. I'll put it in the video and show you anyway. But, yeah, if you want that, it's yours, buddy. All right? Fish have perked up. There's the heat Suri from Pickles Puddle that needs moving on. But yeah, they're doing alright. They're doing alright. I think Koi like music. Because as soon as our music starts, 
they're up dancing about like a good one. Hey, disco time in the pond. Yeah. Oh, no. I haven't had too many smarties today. I'm just fucking happy. So yeah, as you can see, skimmer filter's on a bloody good boil. That one's been cleaned. That one's running. Can't do fuck all with that at the moment, but between myself and the Skegster, we might be able to get that sorted out soon. Cheers, Skegster. Nah. But yeah, that's about it at the moment. So, uh, can't do no more of the pipe work at the moment. So I think what I'll do is I'll go out the front and I'll get the uh, Alpha Grog and the, uh, the Calla Lily and I'll get that put in place. And then uh, I'll put some water in and see if it holds. Back soon. Hey, I'm we're back and you, Brizzle Coy, I see you. <laughs> well, my hands are like ice blocks now and I could hardly fucking move them, but that's the end chamber done. Let's see if I can get up here without breaking my neck again. <laughs> right, let me spin you around. So yeah, I've got to take the grilling out the bottom of here so that the brush is. Let me spin you out a bit. Wet, cold fingers, sorry. No, not in, Vincent, you dickhead. Out, out. There we go. So I'm going to leave the vortex empty brushes will be down lower than that because the grill will be out at the bottom and then it will go through the brushes up through the active k1 that's going to be in there it will then go down through the jack matting which will have aeration in it as well and then it will come back up through chamber full of alpha grog and calla lilies so that's about all i can do for the minute on this one i know i've got to get a shelf up for the air pump which I've got, it's in there, it's the green one in there, I'll just stake my fingers, they are fucking killing me, I'm telling you, fucking killing me, I tell you. So yeah, that's, that's the Alpha Grog finished with, so if anyone wants a bit of Alpha Grog, just give me a shout. <laughs> I've got a load of pipe here as well, a load of two inch pipe, and I've got a load of inch and a half pressure pipe if anyone wants it. Come and it's yours if you want it. The only thing I'm keeping hold of at the moment is the inch and a half because I've got to sort out my waist lines. And I'm not talking about my stomach. <laughs> so, here we go. Hey, right, let's go indoors a second. Try and warm my hands up. Oh, fuck that boy. It's fucking prison. But, yes, let me spin you around. Look. Here we go. We've got a funky box. So, let's... Like, let me let me see if I can sort of tripod out with my fingers like this. Ugh. This is gonna be a mission. My fingers aren't working. Mm. <laughs> no, you fuck bag. There we go. So if we stick that up there like that. Balance your shithead. No, don't topple. That's it. So what we've got here <laughs> is my new microscope. And it's new to me. And it's a Bressa LCD Milano. And in it, you've got these, I put these bits in there from uh, from my stock. But you've got your bits there, and then we have the kitty. Oh, look at that, cupcakes. LCD screen, all the way up to 400 times. Jobs are fucking gudgeon. So let's get this put down. Get he plugged in. Without throwing you around, <laughs> it'll be down there, a bit more fucking safer then, isn't it? Here we go, so, if we turn that round there like that, if I get these, uh, these here, test slides, what we got, uh, Stem of a cotton XS. So, 
we turn the light on. Whoa, wow, look at that. And then, and it's not going to take a lot of focusing. Look, zoom in, zoom out. There we go. Look at that. Tell me that's not beautiful, huh? I am so over the moon with it. It's going to make my life so much easier. But look at the quality on it. And so this is this is the slightly lower end of the market from what I've worked out. You've got this one, or you've got the uh, the Celestron, and the Celestron. I mean, when I when I when I looked at one on eBay. I looked at it second hand to start with and they were starting at 250 quid. You're looking at four, about 450 to 470 quid brand new for a Celestron. And from what I've been told, they are the top of the, the range where the LCD uh, microscopes are concerned. But with what, with what I've got there, I mean that, the clarity on there, guys. So, there we go. That's that one. And, uh, like I said, well, I'll we'll turn that one off. One click, press and hold, power off. Move you to one side. So here you go, Will, Will's Koi and uh, Wire Bonsai Trees. If you really do need a microscope, mate. This one used to belong to uh, a really good friend of mine who passed away, uh, Barry. And uh, it's yours if you would like it, my friend. You've got the, uh, the attachments to put it up to a computer. Other bits and pieces in there, including a uh, a CD-ROM. Fucking hell, I don't know if people even use CDs anymore for, for computers. But there you go. All in its beauty and it, it's an entirety. It's a, it's a Bressa Biolux AL, my buddy. So if you would like it, give me a shout and we'll sort out either we'll sort out some postage or uh, you can come and collect it, my friend. I'd rather pass it on to someone that's going to make use out of it. And not only that, you're ex-army. So us boys, we've got to stick together, haven't we? So there's my new microscope. I'm chuffed to bits with it. I've got a few more bits to do outside, and then I'm going to gonna bowl one up, and I'm going to do a scrape. So we'll, uh, we'll record that as well. And uh, we'll give this thing a proper test. What do you reckon? Back soon. Hooray! Hooray! Anyway, there we go, we've got the bowl out. I'm just about to get the net out. I've got my cards. Plastic cards. So, there we go again. Where's the Makashi? He's the one that sold him, so that's who we'll scrape first. comes away from the skimmer. Oh, she's got some body on her now. Oh, she's got some body on her now. Looks like I'm going to have to get a bigger bowl, guys. I need a bigger round bowl. So, stand on these pipes. So what we'll do is come here swing out. Come on. One. Flip it upside down. And we'll go. 
Now we wait. Come on. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And we go across the bottom. No, come on. There we go. And then we go from the gill plate across the bottom towards the vent. And there we go, we've got another one. So we've got two scrapes. We'll let her go. Keep hold of these. Put me net back. And let's go in here. Where are we? Let's stand you there a second while I sort these slides out. Get one. There's one slide. There's another one, so we'll get these onto uh, onto there. That's one. That's two. A drop of water from my finger. Get myself a cup of glass. Oh, bollocks, there's two of them there. And we put that one in. Give him a bit of a squish. God, oh, that was a big bit of fucking uh, slime. So. Let's bring her back over. Switch her on. And we're on times ten at the moment. Uh, I've just got to get this all uh, focused in. There we go. Right. Bring her out. There we go. So if I bring it all the way down to the bottom and we'll start start there and move across. Can't see any movement at the moment. I tell you what, this is so much easier, guys. Oh, this is going to be a lifesaver for me because my eyes are uh, my old eyes struggle a bit with the uh, with the normal one. We're going that way, aren't we, Vincent? Dickhead. There we go. To the top of the slide. And now we come along slightly. And we go back down. Yeah, this is this is gonna this is gonna save me headaches and eye strain and the rest of it. So yeah. Absolutely no movement whatsoever. So far that is.
taken up to uh, 400 times. Just a bubble. So they, I'm going to continue looking at this slide, guys. I'm not going to bore you watching uh, watching me look through uh, a scrape slide. But there you go, guys. Oh, that's better. The Bressa LCD Milano. I would recommend it because I think that's fucking brilliant. Back to you soon. Um, a bit of specials there with Ghost Town. Oh, oh, oh. Well, that's me happy as a pig in shit at the moment because there was absolutely nothing on either of those scrapes. So thank fuck for that. Probably just having a funny five minutes. They all look good in here. You see he's up and about. Everything else is moving really well. Let me switch you out there. So there we go. I can't give a slurp, my cup's empty, so we'll have to wait till later. Yep, so that's as far as I can go on there for the minute until one, I go and see Brad later, and two, that's the next job. We're going to go in and we'll recondition uh, this bit here. We're going to have to cut in there, take the inner pipe out, take it out, and then I can glue that in place. And then that will give me my 90 to go straight up into there then. So, yeah, everything's done in there. They're all uh, cleaned and up and running. And as you can see, I've had to take my sign, my, my, my plaque off of the door. Uh, it's back down at me dad's. The reason it's down me dad's is because I came out a couple of days ago and I looked at the door and I thought, what the fuck? One, one section has gone mouldy or started to go mouldy. I think we've caught it before it gets any worse. So. Yeah, Pa's going to have a look at that for me. I'm absolutely fucking devastated because it's just a beautiful piece of wood. And it's an amazing piece of fucking uh, CNC work. And righty, I want to do it justice. So it's got to get done right. That's why it's no longer on the door and it's back down to Pa's to get sorted. So on that note, I'm going to uh, go in there, grab the heat gun and a couple of screwdrivers and some pliers. And we'll see if we can get that out. And... Uh, and then we might wrap up today's video. Oh, we haven't seen the fry in a couple of days either, have you? So we'll take you through and have a look at the fry as well. So, uh, back to you in a bit. Oh, I don't know what it is. Something about selfie sticks, they just don't like me. Fucking legs snapped on my fucking new one. Good job my daughter bought me a fucking tripod for Christmas, isn't it? <laughs> well, I fucking don't know what it is. Just fucking selfie sticks. So we've got a ball valve, yes? And as you can see, you've got the outer sleeve and then you've got inside there is a piece of inch and a half waste pipe not posher pipe so what i'm going to do is i'm going to heat up the inside with the heat gun until it goes a bit soft and then i'll put a screwdriver oh get my finger right down in between the two and i'll pull it out and as i pull it out i'll get in there with the old Along those pliers, then you snip and then twist. And as you twist, you should be able to break the seal of the uh, the solvent weld. But let's give it a go. You ain't gonna like this because as soon as I turn that on, you're gonna fucking shit yourself again. I'll rest my case. Anyway, let's have a go. Oops bring you down a bit so you can see what I'm doing. I'm running around the inside of the pipe. I'm 
There you go, now it's going soft, you can start to see the join. Sitting on your screwdriver, Vincent, your dick. There we go. There we go, look. And we put long, nice pliers in and we just turn. And there we go. All ready to go where I need it to. And it's that simple, cupcakes. It is uh, that simple. <laughs> Warm it up till you can see the joint starting to show itself. Put a tiny little electrical screwdriver in there to give you uh, enough to be able to uh, pinch it with a pair of long nose pliers. And then you just turn. And as you can see, oh, get your camera right, it just breaks the glue away. Rubbish, job done. On to the next. So what we'll do is I'll pick you up while um while you're on the the the, 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 the tripod, and uh, we'll go and have a look at the uh, the ickle ones, and then I think we will wrap things up for today, because I'll get that done and fitted in once I've got the uh, the boot, so I know exactly where I need to be with it. But on that note, guys, I'll leave you with. A shot of the uh, the fry, but as always, folks, I'm a twisted koi. You lot out there, I've always been and always will be great, and I'll catch you on the next one. Da, 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 that's all, cupcakes.